Hi, welcome to Wise Guys. Polynomial long division. This example is without remainder. That means it's divisible. I show you this one is a trinomial divided by a binomial. When we do long division, first we need to check if the polynomial is in the same order with the binomial. That means here is x squared, then x and constant. And here is x and the constant. That means they follow the same descending form. x is 2, 1, x is 0 exponent, which is 1. So that's why this becomes 14 is a constant. So this is a 1 exponent, this is a x is 0 exponent, that's a constant. So this is the first step. Second step, then we write into the vertical form 15x squared plus 29x minus 14 divided by 5x minus 2. So because this is binomial, so we need to divide by this one, 15x squared plus 29x divided by 5x minus 2. Two terms matching two terms. But we need to fix, focusing on to try to matching the coefficient of 15 with 5. So we are always cancel the first term because there are 5, 2, 15, 29. Which one you focusing on, right? You focusing on 15 with 3, 5. So the number is multiplied 5, you got the 15, which is 3, right? You first figure out the 3, 3 times 15, you got the, uh, 3 times 5, you got the 15. And this is x squared, so this is x. That's why you need another x. That means 3x multiplied 5x equals 15x squared, right? This is you need exactly the same with 15x squared, so that we can cancel out. The next second term is 3x multiplied negative 2 become negative 6x. and subtract. And 15x squared minus 15x squared cancel out. Got 0. And 29x subtract 6x. That means very be careful. A lot of mistake made at this step. So that's why we can follow the subtraction with integer. Subtraction with integer, the rule is adding, add its opposite, right? Add its opposite. So means subtraction, now we change it to adding. And its opposite, the negative 6x become positive. That's subtract, subtract uh, an integer, become add its opposite. That's why we do adding, it's much easier. So this is 35x, and also positive, right? And carry down next digit, minus 14. And same thing, we looking for which number, multiply 5, got the 35. So 5 multiplied 7, got 35, right? And also this is positive, that's why this is positive. And the 7 multiplied 5 equals 35, 7 multiplied x is x. And the second one, 7 multiplied negative 2 equals negative 15, ne negative 14. That's can you see, it's divisible, it's divisible. Subtract 
equal to zero, right? Equal to zero. Now, so the answer is three x plus seven. This is presented by Wise Guy. Thank you.